state of New California, notice to all Californians, grievance number 26. July 17th, 2018. New California is a new state in development exercising its constitutional rights to form from the state of California. The process to form New California is authorized and codified in Article 4, Section 3, and 4 of the United States Constitution. Article 4, Section 3, United States Constitution states, New states may be admitted by Congress into the Union, but no new states shall be formed or erected within the jurisdiction of any other state, nor any state be formed by the junction of two or more states, or parts of states, without the consent of the legislatures of the states concerned, as well of the Congress. Statement of Intent. The citizens of New California have decided to remedy the abuse of powers by the government of California by exercising their right to form a new state provided in United States Constitution, Article 4, Sections 3 and Sections 4. We are determined to live under a state government in the United States of America and under the Constitution of the United States. New California Declaration of Independence of January 15, 2018 states, whenever any form of government becomes destructive, it is the right of the people to alter or to abolish it and to institute new government. When a long train of abuses and acts to seize and hold the people's power without legal authority and pursuing invariably the same object that clearly demonstrates a design to reduce them under absolute despotism, it is their right it is their duty to throw off such government and to provide new guards for their future security. So it is the history of the past and present governor and government of California who have a history of repeated injuries and usurpations, all having in direct object the establishment of a tyranny over the counties of New California and the state of California. Whenever any form of government becomes destructive of these ends, it is the right of the people to seek a constitutional remedy to the abuses of power. Preamble of the New California State Constitution states, we, the representatives of the undersigned counties within the state of California, seeking a Republican form of government, protection against foreign invasion and domestic violence guaranteed by Article 4, Section 4 of the United States Constitution, and all privileges and immunities of citizens in the several states guaranteed by Article 4, Section 2 of the United States Constitution resolve to establish New California as a fully vested state of the Union of States in the United States of America. First Amendment of the United States Constitution states, Congress shall make no law respecting an establishment of religion or prohibiting the free exercise thereof or abridging the freedom of speech, or of the press, or of the right of the people peaceably to assemble, and to pertain or petition the government for a redress of grievances. Therefore, the counties of New California bring forward 40 grievances against the government of California to be announced in public on Tuesday at 11 o'clock a.m. each week for 40 weeks. State of New California. Grievance 26, Statement of Facts. The people of California are suffering from a tyrannical communist state government which fails to provide a republican form of governance, enables and supports across its southern border the invasion of the United States of America by illegal foreign nationals and protects vicious criminals who commit outrageous acts of violence upon the citizens of America, all caused by a government of and for a monoparty system led by a tyrannical dictator. Declaration of Great Grievance, <clears throat> United States Constitution, Article 6, Section 2 states, this Constitution and the laws of the United States which shall be made in pursuance thereof and all treaties made or which shall be made under the authority of the United States shall be the supreme law of the land. And the judge, excuse me, the judges in every state shall be bound thereby anything in the Constitution or laws of any state to the contrary notwithstanding. 
the communist California government and the current governor have fostered, supported, legislated, enacted, and enforced unconstitutional laws and regulations in direct violation of Article 6, Section 2, known as the Supremacy Clause. The communist California governor, the communist monoparty system, and the local communist officials have engaged on a regular basis to ignore the very laws and regulations they themselves impose upon the United States citizens living in California. Utilizing an industrialized hyper-legislative process which calls for the California legislature to convene for 11 months of each year, the communist monoparty members of the Assembly and Senate can impose any oppressive law they wish at any time upon the citizens of California. Working alongside a communist California governor, the oppressive legislation they approve is eagerly signed into law. These oppressive laws are designed to destroy the very fabric of the United States Constitution, the Bill of Rights, and reduce the California Constitution into a useless document that benefits only lawless criminals and communist government officials who punishing law-abiding citizens living in California. The communist California governor, the communist monoparty system, and local communist officials have created a lawless culture which stands in direct opposition to the Supremacy Clause in Article 6, Section 2 of the United States Constitution. The California government and current governor are not superior to the United States Constitution and the laws which flow from it. Yet on repeated occasions, year after year, not by mistake or accident, during the tenure of the communist government and communist members of the monoparty system, have passed, enacted, and enforced laws which stand in direct defiance of the United States Constitution, the effect of which has diminished the constitutional rights of the citizens of California to the point as to threaten the union of states of the United States of America. Commitment of these acts constitutes sedition by the communist California government and communist governor. Utilizing Marxist-Leninist and Maoist revolutionary tactics, the communist California governor, monoparty system, and local government officials support and celebrate these tactics as a means to introduce and subvert all aspects of California government and civil society in an attempt to destroy the state of California and break down the sovereignty of the Union of the United States of America. Acts of, subs Acts of Secession Therefore, the California Communist government, in conjunction with the Communist State Executive, instituted wherever the current Communist governor has usurped power, has created a reign of terror on United States citizens living in California with the intent to secede from the United States of America and thus destroy the very union of states which govern, gives us our liberty and freedom. Abdication of authority. Betrayal by the sitting communist governor of California, the monoparty legislature and local elected officials is evidence of abdication of the responsibilities of authority and sovereignty over the state and citizens of the United States living in California. This concludes these proceedings. NewCaliforniaState.com, 1877-827-2753. That's NewCaliforniaState.com. And we can be contacted at 1-877-827-228-2753. Thank you.